Bless the children in the world. This is your Father in heaven speaking with you now. The I am of all creation, lover of your soul, protector of your life, healer of all your disease, bringer of your soul into paradise. I love you, my children. I wrap my arms around you this day. For I see your pain, I see your fear, I see your struggle, your anxiety in these uncertain days. Great havoc is spreading globally across your earth at this time. Days of darkness are ahead. I am with you, my children. I have not left you. I will not forsake you. I wish to be your God, your Father in heaven, your healer at this time. Put your trust in me, my children. Put your faith and hope and love and trust in my hands. I have always been here for you, my children. I created you. I know how to heal you. Loriana Kashi, come to me this day, my children. Ahiana Kashi, place your hand in mine. And I promise that we will walk together through this journey. I love you, my children. I see all that is happening in your world at this time. I have not forsaken you to the grave. Anna Haryana, be filled with my Holy Spirit this day, my children. Do not exalt coronavirus above me. Do not think coronavirus is stronger than your God. All things are under my will and control, my children. But you must place your hope and faith and trust in me. You must be led by my Holy Spirit. You must listen to all I tell you to do in these days. If I tell you to stay inside, my child, you must stay inside. If I tell you not to go to a certain place, a venue, then you must stay home. You must be obedient to my words, my children. You must listen for my voice. I will lead and guide you to safety, my children, but if you go against my will, if you walk where angels fear to tread, then you are going against my will and commands, and you are putting your life in danger. My children, there is enough food and provision on the earth for every human being at this time. But greed will arise during these days. The greed of man, the panic, uncontrollable panic is starting to emerge all over the world. Brace yourself for this, my children. Yanaka, come to me in prayer. Kiyada hash each day. Arise early. Kiyana give unto me your morning, your noonday, your evening in prayer. And I promise to speak with you one on one. Every situation is different, my child. Every person is different. And I want to speak to you all individually at this time. I will listen to all you have to say to me, my child, and I promise to answer your prayers. 
And the heart, my ears are open to your cry, your heart cry for the nations, for your family and friends, for your home, for your country. My shikitirari, my child, the world has fallen into great darkness and sin. The world has stopped attending my churches, praying unto me for all their needs. You have fallen into sin and debauchery, into addiction and temptation, into pride and lust, greed and envy, adultery. The world has become complacent to sin. You will be judged for your sin, my children, if you do not confess your sins, if you are not saved and redeemed by the blood of Jesus Christ who died for your salvation. If you do not believe in him, then you will be judged for your sin. It will not be wiped from your soul on the day of judgment. The world has fallen into great wickedness. It has walked away from my will and commands, my holy word, what I have advised you to do and not to do on the earth. This is not acceptable to me, my children. Punishment is severe for those who walk away from their God and do as they please. It will end in sickness and death, for I will not be able to guide you and teach you. and heal you through my spirit. You have become a law unto yourselves, my children. I am love. And there are rules for your earth, for living well. You cannot do as you please, even though you want for everybody to do as they please, and this is okay, it's not okay in my sight. I know the human mind and condition of the soul. I know what is good for you and what is not good for you. And you must listen and be obedient to my holy word. It is written there for you, my children, for the wellness of your whole being. Do not think you can do half of my word and then sin for the other half. Do as you please. There is so much sexual immorality on the earth at this time. People are sinning before me in a million different ways. There is no purity in your marriage in your love life. Great sin is rampant across the earth. My children, you must listen to your Father in heaven at this time. All that matters ultimately on the earth is that you love greatly that you surrender unto me your whole heart and soul so that I can lead and guide you through these darkened times. Many, many have turned their back towards me, Pashikitariya, and walked into the darkness. They wish to satisfy the lusts of the flesh. It cannot be satisfied, my children. Only I can satisfy your flesh with my Holy Spirit. Only I can bring you great peace and contentment in life. I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Repent and be saved this day, my children, for the kingdom of heaven is near. You do not know if you are going to get this coronavirus and die tomorrow. You do not know. The world is being awakened to life and death at this time. Great fear rises in man, for suddenly you realize that your life has an end and it could end soon. 
sooner rather than later. Mokori anakashiki tiki anaha, the fear of death is real across your planet on this day. The fear of losing your possessions, your job, your finances, your health. Death is real, my children. Hari anoki and you will end up on the other side of death. I exist. I am here. I created all that you see. I am the word. I am your life. Your life source on this day. I am your breath. Every breath you take is because I have willed it to be. Alari anoko, but there is free will in man. You do have a decision to make while you live and breathe upon the earth, and I would make it today, my child. For tomorrow is promised to not a single soul on the earth. I know all the days ordained for you. They are written in my book, but you do not know. Come to me this day, my children. Return unto your God. I am real, I am here, I exist, and I am speaking with you now. Through this servant who hears my voice, through these two messengers, whom I have called and chosen to speak unto you in these last and final days. As the world grows darker, they will continue to speak my messages of truth and hope and life to the world. Listen to them, my children. Help them to share these messages with the world. To all those you know who need encouragement at this time, who need salvation, who need to know there is a God in heaven who loves them, their Father, their creator. Do not listen to the world. The world is crumbling around you. Politicians are crumbling. Financial markets are crumbling. Sport, everything that you have exalted above me is about to be shaken. Businesses will fall. Celebrities will fall. Ah, Nianaka, there is a great shaking on the earth at this time. All that is left is me, my children. All that is left, Hariyanakashikitereana, is your God. Those who stand firm in faith, in love for me. Aha, shikete, ama, shikete. Will be lights unto the nations. Kanamoku, start to read my holy Bible, my children. Start to pray. Start to worship. Kanahashike, enter my rest. Great fear and panic is amongst you. The human mind cannot cope with such as all that is happening on the earth at this time. All the things that you thought were secure and certain are falling away. And what is left? Your money cannot save you. Fancy homes and cars cannot save you from disease. Even medicine at this time cannot heal you. You must trust in me. I am your healer. I am your deliverer. I am your salvation. I am your God. Come to me this day, my children. I love you with all of my heart. You are welcome into heaven. Every single one of you are welcome into my heavenly realm. I have provided a way for you to enter into the throne room of grace, to enter into my presence, pure, cleansed, redeemed, delivered of sin, through the blood of Christ Jesus, your Lord, my Son, he came to the earth for you. He lived, he died, and he rose again. So that you can live 
and die and rise again to my children. If you refuse me on this day, you will be separated from your God in the life hereafter. Because I have given you free will, I will not force you to love me, to give your life to me, to be obedient to me, to listen to my will and commands. I will not force a single human being. But oh my child, when you come to me in love, when you realize I am your God, I am your future, I am your eternal life, your heart melts in love for me as mine melts in love for you. And when we become one, when our spirits connect, there is no greater love you will ever experience in your life. The love of your God intertwining with the human soul, the peace of God which surpasses all understanding will guard your heart and mind through Christ Jesus, your Lord. You will be healed and set free and delivered. You will be filled with joy and peace and life everlasting. The veil that has been covering your eyes will be lifted. And you will see me for the very first time in your life. You will see me with your spiritual eyes, my child. I will open up heaven for you to see. All that is to come in your future. You will change, my child. You will know when the Holy Spirit of God fills you because you will change. You will want to change. You will not, will not want to continue in your life of sin, in lust, in debauchery, in greed, in envy, in pride in wickedness, in adultery, in jealousy and gossip. There will be a conviction of your spirit. That is my spirit within you, my spirit of righteousness. You will be tra changed and transformed and bring your mind renewed into the image and likeness of your Lord Jesus Christ. You will fall more and more in love with him each day. Oh, how the angels worship him. How the whole of heaven adores him. Fall to your face before him. Experience this wonder, this mystery. This mystery of love for Christ your Lord. Allow him, his spirit, to dwell within you. Feel him, feel his love. Read his words, listen. Listen to all that he commanded on the earth. Be one with him this day, my children. I am with you. Do not fear the coronavirus. Do not fear others, the words of others. Come to your God. I know all things. I know how to keep you safe and to set you free. I know how to heal you of all disease. Meditate on my word night and day, my children. Come to me in prayer. Do not be like the rest of the world who has no hope. I am your hope. I love you, my children. Come to me this day through Christ your Lord. Repent of your sins. Turn from your wicked ways. Give unto me your life. And I promise you will walk freely into heaven at the end of your days. Peace be with you this day, my child. Peace and rest. I will lead you beside still waters. I will restore your soul. Turn your eyes towards Jesus. Turn your eyes towards me now. There is nothing more important in your life.
Amakashiyanakate. Rest in me this day, now and forever. Your Father in heaven. Amen.